right now we have solo shows by three local artists on view here at Plush Gallery. Andy Don Emmons, Norman Carey, and Victor Ortiz. Let's take a moment and look at the work from each of these artists. Most of this work was done during 2020 while we're down in lockdown and these drawings, I get up in the morning, I make these drawings usually, drink my coffee, try to figure out what I, what I dreamed about or what I was feeling that morning getting up. I was doing a lot of memory drawings and I kind of got out of doing that. I kind of run out of memories for a while. I went around enough people to, that knew me or knew stories that I could remember things. So I started doing these just kind of, I guess, therapy drawings is what I call them. They're just characters out of my subconscious and out, coming out of the TV and everything else. And there's a self-portrait of me that was done right when we did lockdown. And I was pretty upset and pretty uh, angst-ridden at that time. I was moving a bunch of stuff from the ranch. I found some old hay uh, cord that you strap hay in. That stuff down in that barn probably close to 40 years and it had rotted. It was Look cool, so I picked it up. Norman's here with us today. How are you doing, Norman? I'm doing just fine. How, how's everything? It's a beautiful day. The first piece I wanted to talk about was called uh, The View From Here. I had it originally in a, in a chess show, and the pieces got broken in transit back to me. It's really, I think, a great example of taking a piece of work and then reworking it the next piece that I want to talk about was called Harvest, and this is uh, several techniques that I've tried all at one time, uh, using cutout dots and then the paper that I used to cut those dots out, and then gluing them all together, sanding them, working the surface. And in this particular one, I've used some nails, some rusted nails that were part of a box that was given to me. In this other piece, I came up with this in a dream uh, one night about uh, a heavy stone sitting on top of a house. And I even pictured the, uh, the little uh, motel from a uh, Monopoly piece. I'd like to step down to this other, this other piece. This, because I've done several puzzles during, during this time, uh, the idea of puzzles and putting things together came to me and I thought I would challenge myself by taking a, uh, a lecture from an old medical school from 1901. I'd had it for years and I cut each line of the, of the uh, lecture up and then I cut each of the letters up. My uh, infatuation with pegboard, which I've used over the years, and in this particular case, I'm, I'm working more with the black and the white of it um, letting your eye look at all these what could be just black dots that I've cut out like the previous piece but they're not they're actually holes and I like the idea of holes in a piece like holes in a story. Victor Ortiz is an emerging artist with a street cred based in social activism and protest art. He is an indigenous artist of Mexica and Chicano descent residing in Comanche and Caddo territory, otherwise known as Dallas, Texas. His works reflect a contemporary view of what it means to grow up brown in America. Influenced by family heritage, as well as his own anarchist identity, Victor works to express an indigenous perspective to contemporary art media. Thanks for taking a look at our shows today. Each of these three solo exhibitions will be on view through the end of May. Take care of yourselves out there. Peace.